Hello class, welcome to this social science lesson about time and history, part three. Here you are our mind map about this unit. Today we will learn about the Middle Age, the Modern Age, and the Contemporary Age. The Middle Age was a time of wars. This period began in 476 AD with the fall of Roman Empire and finished in 1492 with the discovery of America. In the Iberian Peninsula lived different civilizations. The two main civilizations were the Moors, they brought us Islamic culture, and Christians. The Moors built beautiful religious buildings called mosques. Beside, they built strong walls to protect their cities. On the other hand, Christians built wonderful religious buildings called church and cathedrals. They built lovely military buildings called castles to protect their cities. The modern age is characterized by smaller kingdoms became big countries. For example, Spain was born in that age. This period began with the discovery of America in 1492 and finished in 1789 with the French Revolution. Also, its age was a king's time. In Spain, there were three dynasties, Catholic monarch, Habsburg dynasty, and Bourbon dynasty. Philip the Cid, the current king of Spain, belongs to this dynasty, Bourbon dynasty. Also, this period was an invention and discovery time. For example, the steam machine, the thermometer, and the discovery of electricity happened during the modern age. The latest period is called the contemporary age and is considered a time of many changes. This period started in 1789 with the French Revolution and last to present day. The most important changes started with the Industrial Revolution. A lot of people moved from town to cities and they exchanged the rural jobs in the fields for factories in the cities. Also, during the contemporary age has been invented important things in medicine and in communication. For example, telephone, x-ray, radio, television, or, or vaccines. This has been the unit of time and history. I wish you enjoyed it.